Hey everybody, this is Roy Bandari with TalkCondo.com and today I am at the amazing sales office for Arte Residences and I'm joined by the one and only Cash Pashutan, the CEO of Emblem Developments and we're really excited about this launch. I'm really excited to be able to have a few minutes of your time to chat sure. about it. Yes. Um, so one of the first things I want to talk to you about is Emblem Developments. Yes. We spoke about a year ago at the launch of Artform, which is now sold out. 24, 48 hours. That's right. One of the yeah. most intensely demanded condominiums that I remember ever being a part of. So you guys have seen amazing success. I wanted to just sort of get your take on that. What was it about those projects that you felt brought the success and, and why we saw the demand? Up? Yeah, you know, we were obviously very happy to see that demand. And we're a very design forward firm. Yeah. And when we do a building, we don't look at it as just one building. We look at it as a collection of all of the buildings we're doing. And that means that we're not necessarily looking at squeezing every inch of profit for that building if it comes at the expense of cutting a corner or compromising on what our design standards are. And when you do that, you know, you believe in it, but you don't always know if the market's going to believe in it. And the fact is we believe that buyers today are more sophisticated, more educated than ever. They can tell the difference between average and, and passion and attention to detail. And the sales velocity, the speed at which our last two buildings have sold has told us that, yeah, we're, you know, the market can tell a difference. So for us, what do we do? Well, first of all, we spend a lot of time on the design part. Design isn't the finishes. It's more how you feel in a space, how you layout a space. It's the same reason why if you go into two suites and they're exactly the same size, one feels more open, larger, has a better feeling. That's exceptional design. And that's what we're after, whether you're buying our smallest unit or our largest unit. And then when we have that exceptional design, we then combine it with our commitment to high quality materials. When we design a building, we ask ourselves, is this going to look beautiful 10, 15, 20 years from now? And often to achieve that, yes, it will, you need the design, but you have to be willing to invest the capital to use the highest building quality materials possible. For example, in this building, the brick we're using on the outside is the most expensive brick on the market. It's the brick that's used in the most prestigious, expensive neighborhoods in Toronto. That's what buyers are gonna see before they even walk into the building. And that mindset carries all the way through the amenity spaces and the suites. So we're very appreciative that the market sees a difference in attention to detail and quality, and it's led to great sales for us. And we're very excited about what this means for Arte Residences, which is going to be launched in less than a week. Amazing. I want to talk about location. You know, great projects. I think you guys have a really, really interesting way of looking at which sites are going to bring the maximum revenue and returns and investment Definitely. back to our investors. So talk to us a little bit about that and sure. educate me and educate you. No, sure, absolutely right. So for us, coming from an investment management background, we've spent the last 23 years, day in and day out, seeking great investment opportunities. So we know what it looks like, what it feels like, what it smells like to identify a great opportunity. And as much as the building part is creative and it's emotional and it's about evoking that feeling in our buyers, the land acquisition is the opposite. It's not emotional. It's all about the numbers, it's quantitative, and it's about the return on investment for our buyers. So we have a very rigorous process that we go through when we're looking at target sites. And to just sort of summarize it, because I know we're limited on time, the first factor is what we call social amenities. And these would be amenities that are outside of the building, but very close to the site. So for this site, for Arte residents, the social amenities are plentiful because the core of downtown, where all the action is, is just minutes away at square one. The best dining, the best shopping, the best entertainment, employment, it's all there. But you're far enough where you don't feel like you're in the action 24 seven, and when you want to relax and rejuvenate, you have that in a very residential community feel. The second layer of what we look for, the second part of our criteria, is what we call essential amenities. And although the word essential is there, these are amenities that you need, but you don't actually use them day to day often as much, but they're very important. So that would be airport, hospital, schools. Yeah. And when you look at this location, it checks all of those boxes. Pearson is minutes away. You have a Trillium Hospital minutes away. You have University of Toronto, Mississauga campus minutes away. So you're really getting that second layer as well with the essential amenities as well. The third layer is how do you get to these places? Transit. And so what's exciting about Arte Residences is not only do you have direct 
one major transit line, you have several, and that gives you choice. So you have the Air Ontario LRT, you have the BRT, and then because we have plenty of parking, should you be driving, the highway is only a few blocks away, and you have that available to you as well. So this project truly checks all of the boxes from a location perspective, and then we go into talking about how we make the building special, only after we satisfy the location component. So let's talk about RT residences. Yes. Give us sort of the bird's eye, top down, out of how many suites, what we can expect from a suite perspective. Definitely. So it's 427 suites, so it's got great size, but intentionally when you look at the building from the front, it doesn't look like it has 427 suites because what we wanted to do is create that boutique building look and feel. Boutique buildings are more charming, they have more character, and they tend to be more desirable by buyers and renters because it doesn't feel like you're in this big high rise without the same sort of sense of character. What's exciting and, and again, a point of distinction of this building is the amenity package. So we actually went back and redesigned our amenity package because look, the last 18 months has taught us all a lot. And what it's taught us when it comes to condominium living is that it's very important to be able to live life outside of our four walls of our suite. So we went back, we did redesigned the amenity package, we talked to buyers and said, what are the most important, most used amenities? We took that information, we made sure they were in the amenity package indoors, but then we duplicated them to put them all outdoors as well. So in this building, in Arte Residences, you will have outdoor fitness studio, you will have outdoor private dining, you will have outdoor co-working space with state-of-the-art technology, built-in presentation screens, all outdoors. You will also have an outdoor rooftop bar and lounge. Those amenities will be inside, but they will also be outside. Again, whether you're going to live in the building or you're gonna rent it out, that could be the difference between someone saying, I wanna live in that building where I could do it indoors and outdoors compared to one where I could only do it indoors. Love it. Yes. This is obviously an amazing collaboration with Daniel Mazzone yeah. um, that goes throughout the entire building. We worked with Daniel on this because when you look at Daniel's art, it's very synonymous of how we think and what we do at Emblem. Daniel takes a classic icon, a past president, athlete, entertainer, and he creates art to make it feel very modern. And the idea of taking something that's classic and combining it with modern and making it feel natural after you're done is exactly what we do at Emblem. When you look at our buildings, they have a very timeless look and feel, but then we combine that with modern aesthetics, and once we're done, the whole thing feels very natural. So it was a perfect match, a perfect partnership, because we have the same mindset in our own respective crafts. And Daniel was involved in designing some of the spaces, but what's really exciting is we've commissioned him to do a custom, original works of art for the building, which we will hang, and future homeowners will be able to enjoy that day in and day out. But it goes even further, because for investment purposes, this makes a lot of sense. Like you said, Roy, when you look at projects in, for example, downtown Toronto, buildings that have taken the time and spent the money and focused on having that global collaboration, they stand out. And this will as well. So this will be known as the Daniel Mazzoni building. And maybe it doesn't matter today, but 10 years from now, when there's 15 buildings around, you want to have a way of having your building stand out from everyone else's because that's what's going to create increased desirability, increased rents, and maybe increased price. And this will always be known as the Daniel Mazzoni building. I love it. Cash, if our clients were interested in investing, what would they have to do? This package is very exciting and already we've seen a lot of demand in terms of registrations for the project. And so to access a unit, the only way to access a unit is to work with a trusted Emblem partner like Roy and his team. So if you are watching this and you're interested in learning more or want to access a suite, purchase a suite, reach out to Roy. Roy and his team are going to have access to all the floor plans and most importantly, the pre-construction prices. Most important. Cash, thank you very much. Great to see you. Great.